I now have the honor, the distinct honor, of presenting the Distinguished Alumni Awards. This award was established in 1967 to honor and inspire outstanding Barnard women. The award is given each year at reunion to an alumna who personifies the ideals of excellence of a liberal arts education and who has achieved considerable public or professional distinction and recognition in her chosen field of endeavor. This year we have two recipients, and I know these were hard decisions, um, but they're both so impressive. The first is Joan Freilich. Joan. Joan Freilich, Barnard Class of 1963. For over half a century, you have been intrepid and devoted to all you do, starring in a marvelous dual career in finance and French. I think that personifies the Barnard woman. <laughs> it seems you were destined for Barnard, following in the footsteps of both your mother, Bessie, and your aunt, Florence. You majored in French and went on to earn your master's and PhD in French literature at Columbia. For several years, you taught the language you loved before becoming assistant dean and then director of admissions at the College of New Rochelle. Then, in the late 1970s, you chartered a new course, earning your MBA in finance from Columbia's Graduate School of Business and beginning your 28-year career at Con Edison. There, you excelled in a range of areas from accounting and power generation to central operations and corporate planning. In 1996, you were named Chief Financial Officer, the first woman to hold that position in a major U.S. utility. And one year later, you were elected to Con Ed's Board of Directors, becoming Vice Chair in 2005. Through it all, we are especially proud to say that you are a role model and mentor for women throughout the company, and your influence has continued to resonate even after your retirement in 2006. Since then, you've been a devoted volunteer and leader for Barnard, an active alumna serving on the Board of Trustees from 2007 to 2012 as class officer and as a member of the Project Continuum Committee. You are a beloved member of the Barnard community in a, any language, but for now we will say merci. <laughs> we are delighted to celebrate your milestone 55th reunion and honor your energy and expertise with the 2018 Distinguished Alumna Award. Joan, will you please join me on stage? Thank you, President Bylock, and thanks to my friends and family who are... I'm a, I'm a little shorter. Thanks. thanks to my friends and family who are celebrating with me today. My husband, Sandy, my niece, Nina, my former boss and mentor, and Barnard Trustee Emeritus, Jean McGrath, and of course, all my terrific classmates. I'm proud to have Barnard in my DNA. Barnard was different in my mother's day. She started out to be a classics major, but gave up that idea when her Latin teacher, while reading Virgil, started to weep. <laughs> <laughs> she switched to French, and I initially followed her in studying French and in becoming a teacher. But new fields were opening to women, especially in business, and I found myself in the right place at the right time, and also thanks to Barnard with the right skills to make the most of this good fortune. I had great opportunities at Con Ed and help in taking advantage of them. And then it was my turn to reach out to other qualified women and to help some of them make it through the cracks in the glass ceiling 
and maybe in the process make those cracks a little wider. Today in retirement, I realize more than ever how much the women I've known through Barnard continue to enrich my life. We in the Barnard Sisterhood have been through many of the same experiences. We understand each other and we care for each other. I've also met wonderful young Barnard women through the classes I've audited and the scholarships we've sponsored. I wish for them happy and successful lives and hope that 55 and more years from now, they too will know what sisterhood really means. Thank you very much. Thank you.